The following are true stories. May 26, 2003, Aaron Ralston was hiking. A boulder fell on his right hand. He waited four days, then he amputated his own arm with a pocket knife. On New Year's Eve, a woman who was bungee jumping in Zimbabwe, the cord broke. She then fell into a river and had to swim back to land in crocodile infested waters with a broken collarbone. The most amazing part of these stories is when asked about the experience, they all smiled, shrugged, and said, I guess things could have been worse. When your day is a museum of disappointments hanging from events that were outside of your control. When you find yourself flailing in an ocean of why is this happening to me. When it feels like your guardian angel put in his two week notice two months ago and just decided not to tell you. When it feels like God is a babysitter that's always on the phone. When you get punched in the esophagus by a fistful of life. Remember that every year two million people die of dehydration. So it doesn't matter if the glass is half full or half empty. There's water in the cup. Drink that shit and stop complaining. You see muscle. Muscle is created by repeatedly lifting things that have been designed to weigh us down. So when your shoulders feel heavy, stand up straight, lift your chin, hell, call it exercise. Remember that life is a gym membership with a really complicated cancellation policy. Remember that you will survive. Remember things could be worse. Remember we are never ever given anything that we can't handle. When the world crumbles around you, you have to look at the wreckage and then build a new one out of all the pieces. What if all of us took that attitude after we face a rejection and a no or we have a meeting and no one shows up or somebody say you can count on me and they don't come through. What if we have that kind of attitude, the cars repossessed, nobody believes in you, you've lost again and again and again, the lights are cut off, but you're still looking at your dream, reviewing it every day and say to yourself, it's not over until I win. You are still alive. Act like it.